Hey everyone, welcome to the Crypto ZX channel. Happy Saturday wherever you are around the world. You guys can tell by the title of the video that we are going to be talking about Solana. A lot is happening in the markets over the past uh, 24 to 48 hours. A lot of fear once again within the markets. But we are going to be talking about Solana and see what's happening and what are some next price targets we should be looking at and is this a time to worry. Uh, looking at the price of Solana right now, it is currently trading at $21.83, down about 4.7% in the last 24 hours in USD comparative. We're also down about 4% in Bitcoin comparative over the last 24 hours. Market valuation for Solana is currently sitting at $8.2 billion with the 24-hour trading volume currently sitting at $571 million. But now you guys know what we're here for. We're here for the price. So what's happening and where could we be going in the immediate short term? So let's get right into that, shall we? Looking at the price of Solana, once again, we're trading within that sideways momentum and that is more than bullish than ever. And now you guys may be saying, what are you talking about? We will get more into detail with that. But before I begin, you guys already know that anything on this channel is not financial advice. Always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto. But now if I go on the hourly time frame, let's look at the overall price momentum and the movement that it has been doing since January 14th of this year. You guys can see we've been mainly trading sideways for that time but something different is happening this time around and i will show you guys exactly what i mean and you know we're seeing this pattern play out for majority of the cryptocurrency across the board and that is definitely a nice thing to point out and that is that a lot of them are you know holding very very strongly in this momentum phase that they are in and you can look at this across the board and right now we are seeing once again this is a very very important we're seeing this level of support which honestly dates it back you know let's go back down memory lane look at this this was a level of resistance prior but um obviously plays as played as a level of support quite some time uh when we did see wicks below it and you guys can see one two three four different times we got supported by here and um you know fast forward to now you guys can see that's exactly where the price is currently sitting at could we possibly retest that 19 dollars 79 mark which is currently if i do bring out the measuring tool for you guys about a 10 percent move towards the downside could we, uh, you know, retest that? That's definitely a possibility, and let me tell you why. Look what's happening with the Bitcoin dominance. You guys can see the spike that's happening within the BTC dominance. A lot of money right now is flowing back into Bitcoin, and you know this index is one of the best, um, you know, indicator that kind of tells us what the overall market sentiment is. And right now we are seeing a lot of fear, hence we are seeing this uh, spike happening in the BTC dominance index. So if the price of Bitcoin, uh, if you guys watch my other videos i made uh, some urgent updates for you guys as well last night if you guys uh you know see that the price of bitcoin were to retest this twenty two thousand dollar mark and can you continuation uh this downwards trend that it has been uh in obviously a very healthy correction in my personal opinion uh even though it, it is causing quite a big uh, bloodbath across the board over the last 24 to 48 hours but this is needed this is needed before we do see a continuation uh, towards the upside but look where we got stopped at we got stopped literally at that level of resistance at twenty five thousand two hundred dollar mark and that's a very decisive factor uh, decisive factor so basically if we break above that you know i am expecting that the price of bitcoin along with the cryptocurrency market is going to run until april or may of this year before we do see a little bit of a consolidation then that could put bitcoin at 30 to 35 thousand dollars you've heard that correct and obviously that is going to be a very very exciting time for the entire markets but what does this mean for solana now solana has been looking a very very impressive guys and this is mind-boggling to me and i've said this before and i'll say it again Again, you know, despite the fact that, you know, Bitcoin has been showing a little bit of a weakness right now, but that weakness is not really a weakness because at the end of the day, profits are going to be taken and a cool off is very much needed before we do see the continuation pattern towards the upset. But what I really like about um, Solana is that Solana has been trading sideways, sideways, sideways. And, you know, when the next pop off really does happen, you guys know my target is $40. 
and let's say we were to retest guess where we're going to be supported by we will be supported by this 26 dollars to 27 dollar range because we have built such a strong level of support around here so this is why it's important to see the price consolidation before we do see continuation upwards trend happen i believe that you know this cheap solana is going to be like i don't see eight dollars ever again in my personal opinion, unless bitcoin goes to 10k tomorrow then you we could see that happen but seeing eight dollars again is off the table in my personal opinion that was obviously the ftx collapse the um major major fear across the board but if that were to even happen i will you know go insane uh, in terms of accumulation but you guys know the overall market reaction when we did break out towards the upside we literally saw just in just in a week's time we saw solana go 200 percent. you cannot make this up about a week and a half and this caused everyone to go crazy everyone was like oh my god you know if solana is moving oh i need to pick some up but you know as soon as we start consolidating a bit people are turning elsewhere looking for other opportunities and that's where you get burned out most of the time if you are going to get greedy that's where you will get burned out obviously take profits around here if you take profits and keep most of your position still in and put those profits elsewhere in some other coins that you have done your due diligence for then yes that is a smart way to go about but if you're removing in your entire position then most likely you're going to get burnt out in my personal opinion Solana is going to shock a lot of people in, my, uh, in this next bull cycle. I've said this and I'll say it again. And again, that's just my own personal opinion. The reason as to why I strongly believe that is because of the ecosystem. The ecosystem is speaking for itself. It's here to compete with the big boys and the big boy is basically Ethereum and Cardano. It's here to compete with them and we are seeing the interest flow in this blockchain. The future is great and I do believe Solana is going to shock a lot of people and uh, even if the prices were to go down i do believe that this uh support level at 18 dollars and 60 cents will play out as a level of support for us but if bitcoin uh does start heading back towards the upside then i do believe obviously solana is starting to go retest the yearly highs at 27 dollars. but that is it for today's update thank you so much for all the support that you guys show me each and every one of you guys if you guys want to engage with me one-on-one -on -one, uh be a part of the exclusive crypto zx community where we discuss crypto hidden gems all that good stuff if you guys want some tips, what to look out for in crypto, how to stay away from scams, all that stuff, you're new to the markets, link in the description box below the first link. And it is $10 a month, but that does help out my channel a lot and uh, would be greatly appreciated if you guys come join that. But that is it for today's update. I will see you guys tomorrow. It's from CryptoZX and peace out.